Let's do it, Kyle. Let's get you up here. I'm excited about this. Anthony, everything good on lighting, or you want to turn the lights back on? Right on. Hey, how'd you golf? Really well with my team. My team did well. Right on. I golfed good with them. Man, you don't get out much golfing? I have in the last couple of years. No. Dang it. No. It was great, though. I loved right it. On. Loved it. It's a cool course, right? Great course. Got yep. to see some geology. Yes, that was interesting. Took me back to the school days. Yeah. Uh, looking at rocks. I loved it. Yep. <laughs> yep. Well, uh, what I wanted to bring to the, the tournament and this community is this idea that you have an investment strategy. I don't care who you are, what you're doing with your time and attention, your finances, you have an investment strategy, which means you have an investment philosophy of some kind. And like-minded people in the room right here, it's energy, right? By going into oil and gas and trying to do that better, that we're all kind of in that realm with an investment strategy and investment philosophy. And then what rate has done has really opened up the opportunity to say, hey, you can have a lot of tax dollars that you don't need to get taxed on. You can put those in investments and you, you can work with that, right? You can start working more effectively with your finances to invest in energy, to invest in, in being a working interest partner in something. Real Asset Investment Team has built that. Can you just give us a quick intro on how you did that? What was the vision? You bet. So it just really came from personal experience. You know, you, you go to work, do a good job, uh, or you create a business, it's going well for you, and then you give 40% of the government, if you're lucky. <laughs> in some states, 63%. You get federal and state taxes, right? So you're giving the majority of your money to the government and go, this doesn't work. Um, went to school to be a civil engineer and I decided to read the tax code and figure out how come some people were keeping their money and I wasn't. <laughs> All right? Um, and, and then that led me down the path to eventually into oil and gas, uh, the energy space, a lot of tax incentive. So you can legally pay zero in taxes as long as you have a strategy, your investment strategy, uh, along with your tax strategy, you meet those together, you can legally pay zero in taxes and the government's okay with this, right? right? There's ways to pay zero in taxes that's not good. You know, you go to jail for some of those things. <laughs> oh, the other option is to make no money at all, right? But if you wanna make a lot of money and still pay 0% in taxes, we use a tax code to do that. Led us to oil and gas investing. Man, that's really interesting. So high level, mm -hmm. if you had 20,000, 50,000, 100,000, you have at rate have opportunities to invest in and in in return that you're investing in one of your projects or what you're doing you're do you go like really in the personal like strategy with the person like and really understand where are you getting the where's the benefit really going how much money are you actually making back on your investment with this right so we, we look at that as a personal return on investment a lot of investments out there they're going to give you an investment irr and that's true, that investment may do at 20% per year, IRR to the investment. But you can have two investors that go into that and one make negative IRR personally and the other make 25 or 30% personally because of their tax situation. So we have two things that we do. One is uh, personal consulting uh, for a person, for a business, uh, just for your investing only if you want that or an investment company. Mm -hmm. And then we have syndication where we offer investments uh, that meet that criteria for folks that we're talking to. So we have a big group of folks we're working with and we realize they're needing this to complete their strategy. And we're designing investments to meet up directly with that. If we don't have investments, we're, we're connected with other syndicators. We can recommend, go look at this, go look at that. But we're trying to develop that uh, at whatever level. It's personal, business, you know, or in your investment company that you may own yourself. Right on, right on. What do you think of energy? What do you think of working interest? partnership what do you think of energy right now what do you think of this landscape that you're seeing money coming into alan's probably right it's not a ton of money he's, he's struggling he needs another 10 he might talk to you about that right but you know what are you seeing what do you think about it? yeah so what i see is is people are looking for return they're looking for yield today um, what the energy space offers is, is, is primary wealth right everything we do in america around the world is built on energy so it's not going away and i believe that Today, trying to find that yield is difficult. What I like is hearing about the technologies. I like being in a space where other investors, let's call it a hated asset. Mm -hmm. Might be what it is for some people. They hate this space. Maybe they've been burned in the past. Yeah. They don't understand how it works. It looks like a throwaway asset. And you get in a room like this and people say, no, it's just not being operated correctly. Well, from the investment side, one, I get to be investing in primary wealth. 
That's what we always want, right? right? You're, you're not down the line, but it's primary wealth. And then you have great tax advantages. And then because we're buying a hated asset, the price is right. All these things working in our favor to be in energy. And so that's why we are actually, I mean, our shift, my personal shift was back in 2017 or so out of real estate, out of owning businesses and figuring out how do I own energy? How do I own my own right energy? On. It takes a long time to figure that out. And yeah. so we went through that process, we figured that out. And that's what we're trying to help people understand is you can own your own piece of energy, whether it's through a syndication, right? You can get into one of those. And not only do you own your own energy, you feel good about that. There's all these other benefits that you didn't even know were there. Man, I love that. Own yeah. the energy. I only in it. That's that why you call it real asset investing because it's energy, man. It's real. Yeah, real asset investing team. That really just came from having something tangible, right? I didn't want to own a piece of paper uh, to a big global company. Um, I wanted something tangible. We can go to the field. We can see these things pumping. We can see the oil. That's we right. can look at it. You can touch it. You get greasy. I That's love right. that part of it. <laughs> That's right. Um, and, and we look to do more and more of it in the future. Right on. Well, definitely talk to him more about this with opportunities and maybe some strategies to, to link up with uh, real asset investment teams. And thank you, Kyle, man, for everything you, you do. You bet. Thank you. Got a big hand.